Hey, hey, Hotel Hoppers. Welcome to another episode. Today we are checking out a very new hotel here. It's uh, Windham uh, Queen Convention Center. And it's built as a mixed-use property, so it's like a residence and a hotel at the same time. That's why the number is so strange here. It's like 388-279. It's actually the address of the place, and this is um, the room number. And as a hotel, it works as a room 25 Oh, two. So there are three numbers to remember. But come on in and see how it looks like. So this is a standard category. Room slash <laughs> uh, residence. And it's, um, I think, just 35 square meters, but it's very practically um, made. So you have here a dining slash working table. And here is a big kitchen corner where you have like closets for extra if you're staying a bit longer you have your dedicated router hidden here uh, shoe cabinet uh, they also have included like pots and pans so if you want to cook something uh, it's all here um, also other utensils you also have coffee machine and they give some free pods um, it looks like organic Thai aerobic coffee. We haven't seen that yet. But the tea is just like Clipton and Nescafe. And well, they even have the chopping knives. Uh, you have induction stove, a microwave. Here we have also um, more utensils. There is no dishwasher though, so you have to... <laughs> to your own dishes and they have hidden some dishes over here and bowls and cups and um, and more things. Uh, you have also a pretty fancy new um, refrigerator so it's showing the temperatures uh, you can select currently it's like minus 23 and then 7 degrees and it's as it's a new property it's super nice and clean uh, smells really fresh and then this is the living room part so we have a TV here nice cozy sofa for two the TV I think also I see from the label has YouTube integrated so if you want to watch I don't know Uncle Roger YouTube clips or some other uh, Hotel Hoppers episodes uh, you can do it straight at the TV uh, here what's like if you're staying longer, it's nice uh, to get sometimes your laundry done. So they have hidden on the balcony, a fully functional uh, washer slash dryer. It's also brand new. So, um, yeah. Or maybe you want to do it in a way that you're not staying longer, but then once a week you're getting a property where you can do the laundry, then this could be the place. Then this is the bedroom. This could be separated with, a, with uh, like extra, well, this moves a bit harshly, but you can like uh, seal it off if you want to. Um, but it can be also one big room, a king size bed. There is an extra working desk by the table. Um, and you have the light which is quite bright, so if you want to make a video call, it's, it's nice and the background is neutral. So in some hotels at the desk, <laughs> if you're sitting at the desk, you would have bed as a background. Over here, um, this is not the case, so it's actually kind of cool for that. So let's have a look. Oh, it's a bit narrow here. <laughs> uh, what's, what's here? Um, we have a closet, there is a safe, a hair dryer, umbrella, ironing equipment, robes, um, slippers. This small area is supposed to be for a suitcase. And then we have a bathroom. Bathroom is fancy. It has a nice uh, Japanese washlet. Um, some extra drinking water. What's maybe a bit complicated is that as the shampoo uh, it doesn't say which brand it is. It looks like it's written in Japanese and in English, but they have placed it over here. So this placement is a bit strange that if you are having a shower here 
and then you have to reach out to the shampoo. That's that's a great long stretch. And I think it's because there is no s enough space to put all those three uh, in this booth. So I don't know how it would work out. Uh, being a Wyndham property, it also has everything Wyndham labeled, the body lotion, dental kit, shaving kit, shower caps, and whatever you might need more. But it's, yeah, as it's super new property, it feels very good, fresh, new, and, um, and for the ones who want to have a nice swimming pool view, on the rooftop they have nice gym and swimming pool too, so um, something to look forward to. Currently the weather got a bit wet, so we don't <laughs> have video for that, but uh, I will put some pictures somewhere so you can have a look for that. But thank you for joining us on this tour here at the Standard Room at the Windham Queen Convention Center, Bangkok. Uh, if you have some extra questions about this property, Put it in the comments below. We are happy to get back to you. If you want to see other properties in Bangkok, check out our previous reviews. We have been visiting quite a number of places in Bangkok. So um, there is plenty of uh, rooms and suites uh, to dive into. And if there is something we haven't covered yet, but you are interested in, uh, put it also in the comments below and let us know what is the hotel here in Bangkok you're interested in. And yeah, um, happy to kind of put it on our to-do list <laughs> to visit as well and, and make uh, a video. Thank you for joining this time and uh, if you want to stay up to date uh, click the subscribe button if you haven't done already so you'll be also uh, staying up to date with all the next reviews. Or anything. Thank you and see you soon again in a new um, hotel uh, in a new room or suite.